All right, guys, this is a close-up look of the internals of that. A Fender Power Jazz Bass Special. So, inside, here's what we got. First off, we've got the battery. This is uh, just the 9-volt circuit. It connects directly to the volume knob on this preamp circuit right here, right there on that uh, on that board. Now, these two wires go out that are right above that thing, and they go over to the switch. Also, these two wires are on this little. Uh, control right here probably the uh i don't know this might be the tbx control although it looks very different inside the uh the fender guitars that also goes over both of the white wires from those things go to the middle of this switch both of the ground wires get soldered to the side of this switch in addition to that there's also another ground wire that goes underneath this three-way mini toggle on off on and it connects with a little ring right down there all these white wires that come off of here all just go and connect right there it's really messed up that they did this like that because it would be nice if they wouldn't have, but the top wire goes to the top. The second wire goes to the second, third to the third, fourth to the fourth. So while they're not color coded, they do make sense. Now over here, soldered to the top of this pot are the ground wires from both pickups and the ground wire to the uh, to the bridge. Coming off of here, we have color-coded wires, and the color-coded wires go to this little mini on-off-on switch. I don't know if you can read what that little capacitor says. Hopefully you can. The switches from the uh, the big switch for uh, for the pickup selectors. There's your positive for the neck, and your positive for the bridge. And it all comes out to the jack. Oh, it's a stereo jack because. Well, it has to be in order to use the active electronics. So, the little itty-bitty part right here, that takes the, uh, the negative wire from the battery. See? And then the white goes right there on the right-hand side of where the battery comes off. And then we have a uh, braided ground that goes to the left side so that is everything if you've got the parts for power jazz base uh power jazz base special and you just don't know what in the world to do because they've been chopped apart by somebody throwing emgs in them which seems to be what a lot of people did with these things, but you got the original stuff and you want to put it back together. That right there is how you do it. And if you uh, have any questions, you can PM me and I'll see if I can help. So till next time, this is Rexy Lab, making the world a better place, one guitar at a time.